In this video, we will show you four advanced sonar features of the Triplotter Aquamap 252 access. Number one, adjusting the level of detail. If you want to see the highest intensity signal, lower the gain. If you want to see all return information, increase the gain. But this also increases noise and can make targets more difficult to be recognized. To allow the device to adjust the gain automatically, select an auto option. Number 2. Adjusting the color intensity On clear view and side view screens, after adjusting the GAN, you can press menu and adjust contrast to highlight smaller fish targets or create a higher intensity display of a target. To use the default setting, select default. Number 3. Noise rejection These features can reduce the interference caused by noise. Interference adjusts the sensitivity to reduce the effects of interference from nearby sources of noise, like a similar frequency sonar from a nearby boat, or powerful electromagnetic waves radiated from electric equipment and wirings. The lowest interference setting that achieves the desired improvement should be used. Correcting installation issues like cause noise is the best way to eliminate interference. Color limit The colors in the sonar chart represent the intensity of the return signals. Hide undesired colors to eliminate the display of weak returns. Smoothing This feature reduces noise by averaging. Smoothing and interference work well together to eliminate low-level noise. Time variable gain compensates for propagation loss of sound. By applying different gains to different returns over time, the intensities of returned sonar signals from different depths can be balanced. Avoid excessive TVG or weak returns may not be displayed. The ideal end result of using TVG is that if you increase gain until you see a lot of clutter on the screen, the amount of clutter should spread evenly throughout the depth of water. Color filter is similar to color limit. By hiding individual colors, you can hide the sonar returns of specific intensities. Number 4. Transducer installation settings When a Garmin transducer is installed, Aquamap will recognize it and adjust the installation settings automatically. But if it is not a Garmin transducer, you may need to customize the installation settings. Press Menu, Sonar Setup, Installation. Transmit Rate decides the length of time between sonar pins. Increasing the transmit rate increases the scroll speed, but it may also increase self-interference. Reducing the transmit rate increases the spacing between transmit pulses and can resolve self-interference. A lower transmit power value reduces transducer ringing, but can also reduce the intensity of the returns. Filter width defines the edges of the target. A shorter filter more clearly defines the edges of the targets, but may allow more noise. A longer filter creates softer target edges and may also reduce noise. Thank you for watching.